Hi everybody, I'm Kathy Bosco, UX Research Manager here at Decoupled Days with Brian Perry, who just gave a fantastic presentation. Uh, Brian, how do you feel about your talk and all the great questions you got? Yeah, I feel I feel good. Uh, the talk was called uh, Envisioning a Design System for the Drupal Community. Um, and it also kind of got into uh, web components and why I think that's an, an area of potential growth for, for Drupal. But yeah, I, I enjoyed uh, the talk. And yeah, there were a lot of really great questions about um, you know uh, the project and how it could be applied. So it was exciting. You asked so many great what ifs that went even beyond just Drupal, just to the greater PHP community and the power and the various ways you can benefit from web components. It was a really fantastic talk. I have some questions and thoughts to share with you. I'm ready. We started talking earlier, so we'll just have our conversation here. So I feel like um, coming up as a designer and now a researcher, uh, because of tooling I see we're at an inflection point where because of tooling developers, especially front-end engineers and designers got siloed off and we lose innovation when we're not working together. And I believe because of tooling like Figma and web components and all of the, all of the exciting things that are happening now, they could be a renaissance of design thinking between uh, developers and designers together, working together and innovating. And so your talk really triggered that thought in me again. Do you have some thoughts about that? I mean, I'm, I'm definitely hopeful for that uh, that utopia, you know, the uh, scenario where you can uh, build a design in a tool like Figma and either, you know, share design tokens, which is definitely a thing that you can do today, or even go as far as being able to, you know, export the component that can be used in a JavaScript front end. There have been tools in the past that have, have done that. You know, it remains to be seen if we can reach that particular utopia, but I'm glad that people are continuing to try to do that. Um, but also with tooling in general, like I, I definitely have felt the pain that you describe of uh, uh, tooling, especially on the front end, siloing people. Um, I do think that things are starting to improve in that area. Even just some of the common uh, bundlers are improving a lot. Uh, there are things that are succeeding Webpack that is just making, you know, I'm spending uh, less of my hours on making sure things bundle and more on you know building websites or tools or utilities for people. So, uh, you know, I, I hope that applies broadly and uh, hopefully it'll let people do more stuff. Yeah, there's no reason why uh, a designer can't provide the code for uh, some design decisions that we've made together, or you know, vice versa. There's no reason. Uh, developers can't be in Figma helping make design decisions about how things should work and why. Yeah, or at least there is some like agreed upon path for each side to collaborate and influence the other, rather there, than there being you know the uh, classic complete handoff. You know. Right. Yeah. That's right. Right. Well, it was a fascinating talk, and I'm 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 thrilled to see how excited everyone is about the impact that they can make with their organizations and their projects through this type of work. So great job. Thank you.